The FBI now leading the manhunt for Brian Laundrie following the funeral of his fiancee Gabby Petito this weekend. Yeah, their first step is requesting DNA evidence from his family's home in Northport. Fox 35's Kimberly Cuisan is there live for us right now. So, Kim, good evening. What is the latest out there? Yeah, well, the latest is the search at the Carlton Reserve has since scaled back, and this is as the FBI takes over now all parts of the investigation, including the search for Brian Laundry. And I want to go ahead and show you some video. Now, remember, Norport police had been heading the search at the reserve. They had help from law enforcement agencies from across the state, and the reserve is now mainly underwater, making it difficult to find anyone or anything in the 25,000 acres. Skyfox did spot a few crews in the reserve, but we are told the search is mainly happening from the sky now. Over the weekend, the FBI paid a visit to the laundry house, asking for items that could help with DNA matching. A professor and someone well-versed in these types of cases from USF St. Petersburg says those items won't necessarily be used in the homicide investigation. DNA in this particular case, unless we find a third party's DNA, isn't going to be as beneficial as it would be if it was a stranger on stranger. So why the need for items with Brian's DNA? Peter Massey says that could be for a number of things. If remains are found anywhere, they could use them to rule out or identify laundry. It could also be used to tie him to any items found during the course of their investigation. And the focus of the investigation will remain on finding Brian and on how Gabby died. We know it was a homicide, but the cause has yet to be determined. And out here at live in Norport, I want to show you the memorial that continues to grow here. It's one of the peaceful places uh, that many are coming to as this investigation continues to develop. You can see just how large it is, how many people continue to come pay their respects to Gabby. They may not have known her here in this Norport community, uh, but they felt a connection with her as many people have. Now back to you.